Oh. Hey. Well, welcome to Elden Ring. My playthrough. Oh. Um. Yeah, let's talk about it. So, I've not been able to do any recording or anything for about a year now. Okay. Um. Yeah, for some reason, my piece just doesn't recognise me capture cards at the moment. So, it's, um, I've just not been able to do anything. So I figured, you know what, let's stream it, see what it's like. Uh, I know the picture's not going to be great, but the way of me doing what I want to do, I want to do videos and record my gameplays and this is letting me do that at the moment so but I do apologize for the quality that said I'm going to do a I know it's late it's been out two years but I'm going to do a 100% um, playthrough that's every item that's not RNG every armor weapon talisman incantation spell everything that isn't rng i'm going to collect um and i do think i know what everything is but um that's why it's a playthrough not a walkthrough because it's going to play for, just in case i miss a few i'm going to play through it and i can always go back and see what else is uh i am going to do a strength playthrough which yeah i think vagabond will probably be the best one um, no wretch, no vagabond. Name. Since it's strength, let's do guts. Since it's strength, uh, type B. Uh, make sure. Let's see which ones I have saved. Um. Voice, mature voice. Keep safe. Now, for me, there's only three good keep lands between. There's a really good keep safe because that means you can buy everything from the vendor straight off. Golden seed at the beginning of the game is really. I mean, I know that by the end of it, you've got tons. I think it's something like 10 extra that you can't use or anything by the end of the game, but the beginning of the game it's really valuable. The imps are good against Margaret, they, um, they do bleed, and from what I tested I think they got them da down to about half health or three quarters health. They're not too bad. Crap pots because of how powerful sleep is, that's not too bad. Those are keys I think is a waste, because at the beginning of the game there isn't that method you, you pick up more than what you need at the beginning of the game. So that's a waste. So is that. There's not really much. But for me, I don't know. It's between them two, really. Um, I would like to pick up everything, so I'll go for the rune. That should be up. Yep, yeah, let's go. Yeah. I am going to be skipping everything as well. I've seen it a million times for 10 years. 10 years, sorry, 2 years but, um, I'm going to be using summons as well because I'm not in the mood to get all try hard so, using so I'm not really that fussed about summons or anything like that I think if you're in the mood to test yourself and then find out your summons but if you just want to go through the game and stomp on the bosses then use summons at first Uh, fat rolls, let's sort this out, get rid of that. That puts me in medium roll straight away. That, let's sort this out. That, get rid of all these gestures because I just want the ones that you use. Uh, this Scion, I'm just going to die. I'm not going to waste any time with him. Um, I've never beaten him, never even tried. Well, tried a few times. I'm not really interested in 
the weapons or the shield that he drops. Hate that when I'm looking at a bit, mate. I've got my me, um, me internet speed is like 300 download, 40 or 36 or 46 upload. My bit rate, because I'm having to stream off the Xbox, bit rate keeps dipping, which it shouldn't do. Everybody says that as long as you've got like over six, I think it's something like six or ten upload, you should have good internet. I've got like 40, 30 or 46, so I should have better internet, I should have better quality than what I've got. Um, hey, skip, sorry, Torrance. There you go. I love having the silly Cerulean tier on the bottom. That way, I've always got me um, tiers at the bottom. It's easier for me to do. Drop down, go through this. Now, it's probably a common thing, a common knowledge thing, and everyone probably knows about it, but. If you kill with critical hits, it's like a backstab um, or a, um, a parry and then a repost, you get more runes. Not many, it's only like, I think it's like 14 for a backstab and um, 11 normal. Let's have a look. I think that's what it is. Uh, yeah, 11 for normal. Party for a backstab. So, if you want to uh, mid manage or uh, get the most reads as you possibly can from this, then backstabbing is the way. Or uh, parrying if you're any good at parrying. This is also a good place to practice parrying. Especially the boss, the say a boss at the end, but a little mini boss guy at the end. I always practice your parry with them. And you've also got your with this as well, you've also got your um hit this guy just turtles behind this bloody shield. Yeah so you got your your guard when you guard them. Hit them with your heavy straight away. I can't remember what it's by doing that as well. And the way that works is so with your shields, the higher your guard boost is, the better it is for it. So if you've got a light shield that's only 33, that's awful for doing that. If you have a great shield that's 70, 70, I think so or plus, 70 plus, then it's really good for that. So if you want to do that guard counter kind of play style, you really want great moves, uh, great shields, sorry. I don't really enjoy doing that kind of play style. I prefer to dance. And when, it's, when I mean by dance, I mean like just dodge. I can't parry for the life of me. I can't try it every time. And I always try it on the boss that's coming up as well, but I'm just awful at it. I need to move. On my screen, I have a thing on the game that I'm recording, and it's right on the computer. That, to be fair. Where do I move that overlay? Put it top? Yeah, put it top. Can I change? Sorry, have you uh Yeah, that'll do. Nice. Right, so I'll have, a, I'll have a go parrying with this. I'm telling you, I'm absolutely awful. I'll try not to die.
get in? First five one shots. <laughs> There's not many times to get away with that, but mm. right, let's go and collect this. Strength. Nice. Do -do -do. The elevator and up we go. We are playing offline as well. The reason why I play offline, I know that you don't get invaded or anything in this unless you opt in to do that. But I was doing a boss fight the other day and, and a ghost of another player went through and it freaked me out. And I was like, what the hell? And I died. And I was like, yeah. Yeah, that's why. Plus, when I. Um, I have to do like the the jar talisman and all that. I don't have to fight meta builds, which is good. Did I pick everything up then? I think I did. Probably not having a light as well. Should have made sure it should automatically be daytime. I think. Yeah, it's noon. And welcome to Lingrave. Still looks awesome after two years. Basically, all I'm doing is going to get tones. Oh, so I'll yes, chat to this guy. Of course, you without gun. You are fake. Yeah, skip, like I'll skip for everything. If you want to, you, you can always with, you may also behold listen to it yourselves when you're playing. It will lead, even if it graces the castles, the home. It's time you should castle if you. It's time if you cast if you Alright, bye bye. Yes, so we've got that. I'll ignore this guy for now. Try and get some sheep for some um bones to make some daggers. We are gonna need because we've got no bow at the moment. Let's go on Cali. I think it's Cali. We'll have a chat with him. First, there's some runes out here next to um, the post. We'll grab that, and with both the runes, the one that we started with, and this, and um, what we. One mile near next to these bats as well, so we grabbed that one as well. With this, the bats, and the one that we started with, should be good. Hand all these in. We want to buy everything that we can, really. Uh, crafting books, crafting table, the torch, upgrade materials, leather gloves. You're a That's pretty much it. So that you're not, then why not I am Carly. I am of the land. Hello, The land has been its only time. Let's say. You know. You should buy yourself a yeah. crafting essential. The kit costs but the important. Yeah, purchase what we want. We want these two. We want to sell. What we wanted to do. Now we want to purchase. Huh. I'm sure they were leather gloves. Why do I always think they were leather gloves? I'm glad yeah. Anyway, we've got everything we wanted. Grab some of them. Uh, for now we want that there. 
next will be to go and get the map. That's what that's the thing we need to go and do. Go and grab the map and then we'll start marking areas up and what to do, where to go. We'll make sure we kill this stuff along the way and we'll get some moons. Get this guy. Yeah, these these guys are really good for if you want to learn to parry. There's a lot of bosses, um, especially in the DLC. Some of the difficult bosses were parry, and if you learn to parry, trivialise them. To be honest, um, let's get him done. Well, parrying is really, really it's really rewarding, but it's very risky at the same time. The only boss I've ever learnt to parry is a. Uh, Godwin, is it Godwin? Gwen? Gwen and Dark Souls, that's the one. He's the only one I ever learnt to parry, the only boss, because it just trivialised that counter so much. Sneak up to the screen. I'm going to go in the back. Should be in the eyes over there. Yeah, there should be no one. <laughs> We've got them. Get some more uh, runestones. We'll need them later on. I don't need one or two up here, but. Every little helps. You. That one gives you um, crimson tear flasks. Blue ones give you that for the blue flask. That one's called them. Why are called? Right, that's crimson, that's cerulean. Then the grey ones will give you um, upgrade materials or ashes of war, which are really good. So you always want to get the grey ones, no matter what, let's see if can power you. No. I'll off with your shield flash. There we go. Okay. These guys are really good to learn. Now that we killed him, go and rest and talk to Mariner. Mariner. Whatever the name is. Yeah, I'm bad with names. Uh, I, I always have been. Always have been. Have you heard of they serve? But you, I can play turning to aid you. You need only take to the foot First of the give me tons. Then it settled. Summon me. Ah, I bequeath. Use there you it go. summon a torrent. Treat him with. Uh, torrents. Get that there. Get this map fragment. So we might as well clear this place out as well while we're here. Get the map fragments and then go and speak to him. Is it Manala? No, it's not Manala, is it? It's um Oh, why am I so bad with names? It's Manala's daughter. Yeah, that's gonna be the hell. Is it? No, it's not Manala. Manala's the mum. Oh, God, let's kill this guy again. Bats, I hit bats. He's got to turn any second, isn't he? 
He's the one guy you want to be worried about because he's got a trumpet. Two more on the main one for this side. Just get the red stone. We want him to be further enough away so when this guy doesn't alert him. There we go. And I've got a torch. Yay! We can see! sword would stagger him a little bit more than it did, but it didn't. Not great. We have got golden leaves, which means we are getting a bit more wounds than normal. I pick up the great sword, can't remember. Like I said, we are going to be doing the strength building this. Now that will be uh, uh yeah, I did get that. I did get that. Did I get it? I did yes, so we need sixteen strength, I think that was. First we wanna go back over here and get summons. Get our summons. This way, tarnished. May I have a word? Oh, she can. Pleasure to meet thee. I am the witch Renna. I'd heard tell, and upon look at talk, I surmise thou art possessed. Call forth the. Ah, as I, I was entrusted by torrents for. Tis a bell for call. Summon them where the spirits will obey. Now it is thy. We have to find out who torrents former master is. Was it? Uh, to mine intrusion, I doubt we shall again. How long will it be before the time? Bye bye. Right, that. Chat to Melania again. This time, this lie, but now you can see the rays upon the cliff. A demigod. If the rays and the elder as an ally pray to face the. Nice. Shall I level me up for me? Level me up. Let my hand rest upon you. For but a moment. Share them with me. Um so yeah, so first thing we want to do is get a bigger on oh, level to twenty. Bigger to twenty and then we get our strength up. The one that should have got me strength up first. Ah well, yeah, I need to get strength up so I can 
hold this weapon. Ah, well. So be it. Right, let's... So the first thing I want to do is get the map there. Literally the first thing I want. Well, about anything else, I want to get the whole of Lingrave uncovered, so then can uh, mark stuff out and then start our path. So we're just going to head east. Um, head east, why the um, Roombers? Anything that can kill us at this point in time. Could have made it daylight, but I don't think there's any. No, there's no night bosses on the way. Isn't too bad. So. I could get the flask, but at the moment there's not really any amazing tears, so I'm not really that fussed. Get down here. Yeah. I have been why, why, why the jump off. I've been planning on doing a walkthrough since it came out, but about a year ago. Yeah, it was about a year ago. Um I took my PC in to upgrade the hard drive and memory and since then it um it just doesn't work with any of my capture cards. I have three capture cards, a um HD one, a 2K one and a Give me a 4K one, and it doesn't work for any of them. It literally doesn't work. And whenever I took it back in to tell them that they, they broke me PC, they just blame the uh, capture card and say it's them. And um, it costs like fifty pounds each time, and I'm not can't afford to do it anymore. So, and now I'm, I'm not working at the moment because I got laid off, so. I think what the hell I can't afford a new PC. But streaming if I want to do something like this, streaming is the only option for me. Right. Got them. In here, so we're safe. And nice. Right. Where are we going first? Where should we start first? Mark it up. We've got Foster, 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 have a night Foster, Healer. We have Foster, Night Foster. Got a boss around the. 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 Nighttime boss there. Nighttime boss there. We have a. And a mini boss there. Boss there. Um, I think that is it. Got a weapon. Oh no, we've got a boss there as well. A weapon there. We have a weapon there. I have a weapon there and there. We've got an invader there, uh, there, 
Locked. There we've got NPC there. Uh, we have an NPC voice box around vault there, maybe. Oh, yes, there. There, got an item there. There, and we've got a weapon there. Oh. Here, uh, right. See the base, got the the bender, the ash of war, the guy fishing, the got a starlight, the ice up the. Ash is there. Got a golden seed there. Stuff there, there, there. Up there. There. And there. There. Um, base Alexander's about there. A vendor the boss turtle talisman in the item there. Item there. That. There. That you see there, a grace, I think about there, painting there, um, a grace here, a thing there, a crafted book, I think it is, it is, uh, got items and NPC there, there, the grace there, stuff in there. Ended about the, the stuff there. No, I'm not marking everything. So basically, you generally know what's where. So the likes of here, I think it is, is an upgrade which I don't mark. I do mark the one that's on the bridge and the one that's there, and the grace that's about here. Um, you know, because like I'm at 84 already, you know, so I'm not marking literally everything. I am marking the majority of stuff just so I know where, what I'm doing, where I'm going. So there's stuff in there as well, and it's easier to plot out basically. Uh, so the top part, I think, is done. I think that's all done now. Here. I think that's pretty much it. Yeah, I think that's it. Yep, so we're all good. So, what to do first? The out. So, the ones that are out and about roaming around. I'm going to be doing last. Thinking the. 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 The and then the. Yeah. I think we'll do that first. Right. Um. I would have liked to upgrade my sword, but. Oh, no, that'll do. I haven't got anything, have I? 
That's not going to get me level, is it? It'll get me a level. But might as well wait. Might as well wait. Get the um, get the grace, and then I'm gonna have to grab a drink. Mouth is getting a bit dry. Grab these mushrooms. I was I always grab mushrooms when you see them. They um, you use them for crafting your pots. Pots are extremely overpowered. But Always grab your pots. And with that, I shall be back in one minuet. Right, what them what those melon the ones? Me. I'm searching for my purpose. Given for the reason that there is something for which I must apologize. I that I am no maiden. My Meeting when you get your headset. Really comfortable and then when you have to take it off. Put it back on, it's just just can't get it to be that comfortable again. Right, um so the biggest problem with this doing this is that the boss at the end of this is an uh tree watchdog and they are weak to strike. I don't want to strike. I'll have a dark. It's rather dark at the moment. And it is a bit. Not having a uh, strike weapon is a bit of a pain. Let's. Let's right, come down here. stuff at you. That one. Whether he comes down. I think he does. Yeah, he does. Don't come down and start throwing stuff at you. Yeah, he just stands up there no matter what. So 
Leave it. There's a little something here. Can I craft any more of them? No. Bombs it is then. Five here, so there's two there. There's three on the wall, two in the corners. I don't really want one v five. I have done that. So just bring one out at a time. That way you don't get overwhelmed. Find that if you try and rush, you're gonna die. One time. Just take your time. You'll be fine. Absolutely fine. You don't get me wrong. You'll still probably die and make mistakes. And gravity is the, the end boss in this game. Um, but yeah, just take your time. Don't let it overwhelm you. If you're running past a load of enemies, then yeah, you're gonna you're gonna die eventually, and you're gonna lose all your wounds. Especially at this stage, if you've got 100% uh, shield, when I say 100%, I mean physical. So your guard, you. Guarded damage negation. As long as you've got hundred percent physical beginning of the game, just, just do your block counters. Once you start getting good weapons and everything, then you can start um, messing about. Summons in the entire game. So with these, let you know we're gonna fight the dragon. And if you have these, they will run and hide. Do what they'll do when that dragon you go to fight that dragon, they will literally run and hide. Absolute garbage. And we know he's been oh did it not? Well, that's just unfortunate. I will be going up again. It's like I said, I will be using summons because I'm too old to be messing about with that shit. And you know, don't get me wrong, there are times when I feel like being challenged and I feel like doing it. The majority of the times, I just want to play the game and just relax. Yeah, I just want to relax and play the game. Like right now, I just want to relax and play the game. I don't really feel that challenge myself. I mean, there are times when I mess about 
like the, uh, the new DLC just to see what the summons are like for each boss or I'll bring the summons out at the beginning of the boss fight and I'll just leave the summons to it and see how good they are and then when they die I'll just try and 1v1 him then um, which I enjoy learning that way the, um, to 1v1 Right, this thing is not weak. The only thing it's weak to is strike, and I don't have anything to strike. So, I don't have a good heart either. But I should walk. Another bad summons. But at this point, the only good summons you're going to have the dogs. That's it. So. Right, that's done. See if we can level up the strength so we can use that better weapon. Maybe. Maybe. Yes. Let's go up that figure up to 20. I want to get those three up to 20 before we fight Margaret. That'll be good, that'll be quite nice. Nice place to be. Get the mushrooms. Only these have a really good dex weapon, I think it's like a really good dex weapon. Every time I play dex it never drops. So if you do like a strength build or paladin build, it will drop. Um, doing a um I think we only have like two, maybe two or three times it's dropped for me. It is extremely rare. It's always, always been a sort of strength from the Paladin builds. Always. Right, next one. And this one we have... Eastman of Farmazula. He is extremely weak to fire, so I recall. Have a look. Eastman of Farmazula. Yes, he's a minus on fire. And strike. I don't have. Bring the torch out. Um, I always like to craft grenades here as well because these dogs can massively overwhelm you. Don't want that. And then, there should be one there. Oh, you jumped up, you little. While jumping up, you jumping up, you are down as well. What? The two lying down in the low. just caused that noise. Doing stuff. And my goal for this is to be 100% with all non RNG items, weapons. I, I'm not, I'm not going to piss about going trying to find every rune, skull, or every flower, or plant, or anything like that. Just, no, it's not happening. Weapons, 
talisman's armor. Yes, I will. The... I have no fire and I have no strike. The two things is weak to, I have none. So, let's stun him to death. Good, it's still locking. So basically, so later on, we'll get um, get some rat summons, and they're pretty much an upgrade to the dogs. Cause just for that, that's the only use is the stun lock, and the rats are just better at it than dogs. Right, with that done, let me level up again. Do 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 yes. Now we're going to number three. You can kill them again if you want. I ain't fussed. Grab the grace. Talk to Bok. No, Bok's probably down, is it? Um, is it worth talking to Bok? No, we'll do it when we. Because what we'll do with this caravan is that we'll just follow it all the way here. And we'll talk to him then. So. Did I do it so I could? Yeah, I did. Am I heavy loading? Yes, I am. Right, my favourite way of dealing with this lot. Unlock them. That's it. That's literally it. Just unlock them. the camp. No, oh, there it is. Yeah, you'll just wander over and while you're trying to deal with four dogs and two Norse. Ash of War that I actually quite enjoy. Normally, so yeah, that's not too bad.
Ну, вот долги. Guys, fast asleep, so we'll give him a nice little wake-up present. Doggies. Wait a minute, is this this one is this an upgrade? I'm not hundred percent sure. Well, there is an item here. I just can't remember what it is. Nice. I should be able to level up again. And then it is another catacombs. Yeah. Let's clear these off because we've done. Then we'll do, we'll do that. Do that. That, that, then that, and then we'll go there. Yep. Sounds like a plant. Let's see if we can level up more. We'll get to 20. Okay. Yeah. Damage wise, we seem to be okay, so I'll probably just work on endurance. Uh, sometimes this jump works. If you get it correct, sometimes it doesn't. I didn't even get it correct, so obviously it's not going to work. Grab your mushrooms. Don't think this is a skeleton one. I hope this is not a skeleton one, because I have no sacred at all. Do you know? Catacombs, so it's the Grave Warden Duelist. It's weak to weak to everything magic, fire, lightning, holy. I think sleep as well. Yeah, bleed, rot, frost, sleep, and poison is weak too. So it ain't too bad. Too bad. Oh, I'm just fixing something. There we go, that should be okay. Right, let's go. Um, I don't know what it's imps, it's imps. I do want my shield up for these lot. No, I know you're trying to bait me into him. That's what I wanted you to do. Nice. Let's be 
Great resin and open the box room. Should be able to craft fire now. This guy's weak to fire them. Yeah, he is. We'll be able to craft three of them at least. Three more imps here. Aha. Nothing to throw them. Unless you just want to sprint past them and go to the boss, but the problem with sprinting past them and going to the boss is that they'll come around the boss uh, on wall, and if you do use any summons or anything, you're going to be trying to fight them through the fog wall instead of dealing with the boss. So, each to his own, like, but I prefer to kill them. But if you're not using summons, then it doesn't matter, does it? <laughs> the first time I messed about with it was a couple of days ago and wow. It's a gun. Especially on humanoid. It's it just launches them as you can see. Launches them. Boss. Can we level up again? Um we are going to need 14 for the bow. Do that first. That should be golden. We have. No. We bought the uh, up the spirit spring and head towards the next market. this got some poop uh, it's funny one of the reasons why I wanted to um, do this is because my nephew well, Three of my nephews have started I've been playing it. One of them started when it first came out. One of them only started a couple of weeks ago. And one of them dabbled in it a couple of times, but he says he can't get into it. So I thought, you know, I'll do one. But the thing that made me do it the most was my nephew has been doing it. He's been playing it for two years while it's been out. He hasn't had half the stuff. I'll, I'll ask him, well, why haven't you got this for your build? Or why haven't you got that for your build? And he says, I didn't even know you could get it. I'm like, how, how in two years? Do you not know what every single thing in this game is? Two years? So, that's one of the uh, main reasons why. But you know what, I'll do it. Um, we're not working, I've got nothing really else to do. The weather's shitty. So I'll just do it. Um, why have I gone this way? Not the way I wanted to go. Uh, yeah, so we'll have no excuse next time when you tell me, you know, have you, done, have you got this or for this build or anything, you can go, yeah, I have. Then I've, oh, I didn't know that was in the game. Oh, Kenneth, no, I'm going to talk to you, Kenneth. Might as well get the Grace while in as well. Where's the base that is? I 
great kind of heights. Someone who might be interested in rescuing the great Kenneth Height, servant to the True Order. Ah, well, oh, no. despite of you, might have young Tani. I want you to take the night. Would you like what to kiss my boy? Oh, I see. Fred, no. If you're offering. Hmm, yes, I went to pray honestly. Go first, he then he ends up. And to think, yeah. the what girl blows. Right, please don't. And get this. We've got a cookbook. That is probably one of the most important cookbooks in the game. Depending if you like um, cheese and bosses, because you can get the sleeping um, grenades from this. And for the god skins, it is just amazing. Absolutely amazing. So, the cookbook for your sleep. We'll head over here. There's a room bird down here. I, I'd never find There's loads of wolves. There's a room bird. It's just like, yeah. No, thank you. Right, why have I gone with this one? I don't want to go on this one. Wanted to go on this one. And um, Mr. No, not too bad. It's fine. It's fine. Keep telling yourself it's fine. It's fine. First step. That first step. Go see the count because I'm not to stream on the Xbox. I can't have a death counter. Oh, I don't know whether you can on PlayStation. I don't even know how to stream on PlayStation. Um, my PlayStation is in my son's room at the moment. Because for some reason, FIFA on PlayStation has tournaments, but not on Xbox. Hmm. Right, where was it? Where are my wounds? Seriously? Well, I get to get you again. Where does he come from? The moon bear? Is he asleep? Oh yeah, he's asleep. Where do the wolf, all the wolves come from then? There's a lot of wolves that appear from somewhere. chance if you want to do that good luck to you have fun but no thank you we are going to and i honestly do believe this is the best as reward in the game hands down i hate you you uh, sacred blade it's just amazing it puts i mean you can literally make any weapon in the game able to kill the dead. It makes uh, tibia manners, death birds, skeletons, any all of them just piss easy. Best best uh, actual one in the game. What do you want now on there? Spoken words of if you wish I will ship very well. My lord, with thine eye, he will wait well. Anyway. And we get one of the best new additions to Swordsborne games. The Blast Game Physic. I'm going to put 
put that. Flask of wondrous physic. Um, need to allocate them. Do want three. Do like to have three and then eleven, I think it is. The one thing that did annoy me about the um, DLC is that the amount of golden seeds that you have by the end of the game that you can't use and the amount of um, Lone Sword keys that you have at the end of the game that you can't use and you can't use them in the DLC either. Mate, you know. Just, yeah, it was, yeah. That was a bit annoying because they're still in the inventory. Right. Done that. Done that one. That one. And that one. That. Got that. We will be coming back to Kenneth later on. We'll leave him for now. We'll do them too when we've done this other area. And for now, we'll go and get some more wondrous physics stuff. And then the. That. And we'll finish off kind of fight stuff. Going right. him out and let's go. So, oh woods the the full moon birds. So I just wouldn't bother. There are, there's a little pond that has some items in, it's just uh, fireflies and some crafting stuff. Hello. Um, I just wouldn't bother. This, it's just a case of grab what you need, to get what you need and then go. In these woods, uh, at this point in time, not equipped to deal with moonbirds, even though they are extremely weak to sleep. You can't just keep with the sleep pots, you can't just keep putting them to sleep until you run out, that is. Uh, more physics stuff. These ones with them being red and all the um, crimson crimson beetles, so but we have got a national wars over here. It's an ashen water, yeah, it's an ashen water, it's um, a bum flop one. Yep, there you go, ground slam. A bum flop. No, we're just looking for some smoke, which is the. Yes. Dear customer, yes, right, well, are you please? I'm hungry. What is he selling? I can't remember. Sells some monthly upgrades. I want the two cookbooks, that's three thousand, three and a half thousand, and that is it. Well, I'm interested in three and a half thousand. One. Um. Thank you. Uh, in the fort, we're gonna. It's, it's a fucking pain in the ass, the fort. There's a little vat, and there's um, guys from grenades here as well, with loads of explosive barrels around the place. It is a bit of a pain, but. Should be able to get it done. Um, if we had a bow with some flaming arrows, that would make it a lot easier. But we don't, so... That's... Let's sort out our physics. The only decent ones we've got are that one. That one. But it enhances our charge attack and... Gives us a bit more stamina. Careful of him up there. We have got a pumpkin head of our as well, so. Okay. 
Hopefully, normally I'll just hang around this area, clear out all this lot, and then deal with the pumpkin head. Not the pain. As soon as you see him, he'll, um, he'll plunk his, his flag down and they'll come after you. And he's a bit of a pain slamming his head down if he mothers up all these lot around. So I'll take care of these build them. There's just one left round corner. With a, um, with a great sword, so let's go. I'll let to go. Right, there you are. Flag down, heels down. Oh, really? It was that long? Seed. Oh, oh, is it his helmet, please? Yes! I swear to God, I shit you not, in the thousands of hours I put into this game, that's only the second time I've had that helmet. That is awesome. Second time I've ever had that helmet. And I can't show you because as soon as I come off the game, it thing goes into because I'm streaming off the Xbox, but. Dear God. Right. This lot. I hate this lot. See? So, safest place really is in here. Right. Now we get. Dogs out. Book. I've got none of that left, that oh, poop. Right, let's go. Got his great sword as well. Is that better than this? It is. It certainly is. And it's got the same uppercut as well. Oh, we'll be using that. I don't think I've ever used this sword. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, let's go for you first. We'll grab this half of the medallion. Talk to Kenner fights, then come back here. Talk to Kenner fights again, and then carry on. Travel to Kenneth. There is, is it Magic Beast that's underneath the bridge? 
I don't have to have with that art. Crafting material underneath the bridge. Which I don't think I've ever gotten. Right there. Um, just so you know about it. Ah, did you mess? Oh, well done. I knew it. Now, go ahead. Yay. Right then, I've much. What's that look? Well, and even the vibe. Which is why. Just I... you. Ah, yeah. Would you like? I see bright. Enter, and who knows? What say you? Very yeah, well, I knew it. I shall await. You shall hold us. Go I on, see. then, if you ask him. Right then, I've much. What then? Uh, let's travel back a little bit. And for some reason, even though it's supposed to be friendly, there's still enemy humans that want to kill you. So, must be careful of them. If you run past them and go straight to him, they can run up yeah, steps behind you. So, yeah. I think they're there. Uh, They'll be friendly since they work for Kenner Fights, but they're not. I'm gonna pick this up. Just hmm. up here, wait for them all to come. is coming up. Stay down there so I can have a chat with your boss, please. Right, come on, great kind of fights. Oh, I suppose indeed it is a f one must for a true. I'm so but I have the great, but now for a true. I must begin for a true. Okay, so that's him done. He's literally done now until um the valley. Until the end of the valley. Right, that's that done. So now it's the uh go there. Normally we'll just go there, but because I came down instead of going across, so uh, we could go up, couldn't we? Do that, that. Yeah, we could go up there. That doing that, that, that. Let's see it. Four, five, yeah, let's do that. There's no point doing the um, missile runes until we get the emote for Glide. Beach, there's absolutely well, there's one thing on the beach which I think is crab meat or something. Yeah, it's craftable, not fussed. Because we have got runes here. It'll help us level up, help us buy stuff. Yeah, we've got a spinning spring here, so let's just walk over um, to grab a sacrificial twig and a 
I don't know what it's called, it's a red leaf that, um, that we're going to want. This leaf, you can hear a live whistle or howl. We'll just head back. Up we go and more coffins and more wolves. Now there is a sorcerer here that is guaranteed, 100% guaranteed to drop you a sorcerer staff every single time. So if you start on a class and you decide you want to change and become a sorcerer, he 100% guarantees a good stone staff every time. But if you start off as like a hero or melee build, warrior or samurai or whatever, and you decide you wanted to be a sorcerer and do magic, because you found some spells you want to try out, he guarantees it every time. I've got fire for this guy. I'm going to come here and just drop off. Poison, we've got nothing to pick. Poison, I couldn't get away. This had the same move set as these ones. This reminds me of um, what was the sword in Dark Souls 3? With extra human, extra damage against uh, humanoid enemies. I haven't got anything for poison. I can't craft anything either. Um, yeah, we might, it, it's exactly the same as that when you two hand it. It's the same move set. I'm going to have to use all my healing for this. No way of getting rid of poison. I haven't even got. Get the grace before I die. Deal with the bodies. Before we died, of course. Where is he actually weak to, pumpkin head? Where is he? Where are you, pumpkin head? He is weak to slash, lightning, sleep, bleed, frost, rotten, poison. 
He's strong against straight weapons, okay. Right, and now, if you are a sorcerer, you get to meet your first NPC sorcerer or vendor. Tell him. No. It's up to you if you give her scrolls. So every time you give a scroll, they sell more sorceries. The problem is with giving her a scroll that she will say move around, but well, not really, because she's either here or at the Urnia next to Manala. So there's only really so you can give her a scroll because she there's only two places she she's going to be and easily show you where Young that apprentice. is. So first things first, you are a tadpole. With so to now. Okay, whatever. Um, yeah, so at the end of her quest, she stays here, and at the end of her quest, that's when she moves to somewhere else more permanent. So with her, you can give her your scroll. It's not an issue, but when it comes to incantations, um, the guy in the round table that does incantations, he moves around a lot, and I mean a lot, and you can mess up his quest quite easily. So, with him, I suggest keeping all of those scrolls until you find the turtle. Which again, I'll show you where he is. That caravan, we are going to leave for now because we want to go all the way to the end. What we'll be doing is getting rid of all these straps. Big guy there, wait for him. Don't really want to deal with all of them at once. So. Wait for the big guy, wander off, and then one at a time. I'm going for it. Right, let's deal with this guy first. My, um... Hopefully my mic didn't go out because for some reason. So, I, so I, I'm in a party so I can um, see that it's ready to see that. Oh, stop. Love it. Um, so I can see that my mic's working. There's nothing, there's nothing to indicate that my mic is. There's a little icon that says that on. But not that it's working, so I like to come in the party so I can get a thing that comes up that tells me that my mic is working. That was the one. It booted me from a party. Hopefully we'll get rid of the that talking that I've done. I'm not used to doing this much talking, my throat is starting to hurt me, so it'd be a waste. But yeah. Right. The, the, so, like I was saying, there's um, these guys that can drop these nobles. You drop a really good deck sword. If you want to farm that deck sword, this is the place to do it. Um, you've got the Light of Grace right in there. So it's easy if you're a sorcerer or doing invitations because you can wipe them all out pretty much instantly. Or if you've got the sword from the end of the game, you can wipe everything out. Is a good way of best place to um, farm that sword anyway. Bit more hat. Did he give me his hat? No. Just poop. Oh, oh there's a knight. We didn't put it today, and it's nearly night time. Means we might have to deal with the night rider. I do like dealing with the um, the Roman bosses. Um, 
last. Half our sword, please. Anyone half our sword? No, 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 you're all garbage, you're a lot of us. War. I don't know why, but sometimes one of them is supposed to be controlling this area in the daytime before the night rider comes, but there are times when he's not here. I have seen him stuck in the caravan actually a few times, so it wouldn't surprise me if that happened. Um, yeah. Come on. Right. Have you trapped inside it? Maybe. Evening, let's go and speak to Bok. I'm going to start Bok up. So, Bok's quest is it's just a simple little side quest. It's um, basically every time he pops up, you talk to him, and then you eventually you. get this little thing that you can um, use you to talk to people in PvP. And that one of them is um, your beautiful. Let's just say that to him, and that's his quest done. Some if you want the good ending, if you want the bad ending, get him to die. And you don't want to do that. I was pushed out of but the, the good people will, um, told not then I ended up as a tree. will tell him he's beautiful and no. that he's awesome. Oh, Let him live a happy life. They thrown, so this is all I hope. Or there you go. I could, then I. Right. But that should be it. Yeah, that's it. Right. Um see if even any of these would drop us a sword or a hat. Sword. There should be three of them. them dead so normally they'll just they'll keep riding and riding and riding and then eventually they'll stop and you can just loot it then and then deal with them but I'm getting bored once it's get done now I've got the great axe which we won't be able to use for quite a while 
we are at night time so might as well deal with this guy yeah there he is, I was going to say I don't think he spawned but he has mm, again this guy easy, just block, hit the horse, block, hit the horse, block, hit the horse. Eventually, the uh, horse will um, take enough damage where he'll die, and you can just quit him. This, um, who's this guy? It's weak to rot, poison, and that's it. There is weaknesses, rot, and poison. And I have nothing. I can do bleed. Oh, I can do poison. I've got nothing to cure it because it just that will give me poison. Yeah. Yeah, nothing at the moment. Oh well. Come on, Mister. Let's go. I always like to go to the right as well because it kind of um, messes with the horse. They like going on the right or left. I don't I like going on the right. It's really good for rapiers, especially with bleed. Um, that should be it. I've done that. Got that. Got that. 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 But we're swapping that for that icon. Got that. 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 Um, we did block. Yeah, we did block. That should be it for there. No. Let's do... Blythe. Let's go and at least move Blythe's quest and get the um, Darwin. And level up. Um nice we got that to twenty. Case is working on endurance now. Wait, well, you're back. The howl of a wolf, I suppose. Next time you don't fright yourself. There Not are if fixed. the moon my want. people, which is why thanks I think this your people. Perhaps you don't see that we have a say lament not but that is our code, just the way we um, I'm not a hard of runes. 
get rid of him, level up. I'm not a PvP person whatsoever, so I don't care about levels. Um, for me personally, I did my first playthrough of the DLC in particular. I did the DLC at 170, and I struggled a little bit, sorry. And then I started it, I'm like halfway through it on the second character. Same build, both, both Paladin builds. And I went into it at 200, and it's just so much easier because it, you know, even though it doesn't really bump up your defense, your, um, and your damage, what it does is all your immunities, robustness, focus, vitality, it bumps all them up as well. So the higher level, the higher they are. So it just made it just it was just so much easier. So for me, I will be going into the DLC at level 200 minimum. Is I, unless you do, if you're doing PvP, you're basically looking between 150 and 200, from what I understand. I'm here listening to what other PvP people say. Goodbye. It's like 150 no. is for um, like jewels, I think. Um, and 200 is for invasions. So if you have someone who likes to invade the world, with co -op, people who are doing co-op and all that, I think it's 200. But if you're doing jewels, I think it's 150. Well, I think it is. Like I say, I'm not a PvP person. If you want to go into PvP, it's just going online and looking up. There are etiquettes to it as well, and rules. So it is best if you want to get into the PvP, is to, um, is to look it up. Right. What I want to do is level this bad boy up. Plus two. That will have to do for now. Um, right, what did we say we're doing? Blind, that was it. I don't know if this one is safer. Go from the other one, there's loads of moon burrs. I have a chance of bumping into a moon burr, so we'll go from this way. At night at daytime as well. Mainly so, oh, can I have a look? Mainly so everybody can see. I still haven't changed the time of day, dear one. At noon, noon's the best. I wish morning looked like noon. I wish it was this clear in the morning. There are times when morning looks worse than night time. Look how dark it is and how much you can't see. There's a sleeping moon bear here as well. He will, he will destroy you. I kid you not. This guy will destroy you. You let him wake you up. Don't please, don't you come attacking me. And hey, he's crying over there. You are, aren't you? You are, aren't you? I've been laughing all to you, piggy. Right, so he will stay asleep. You can get these lilies. The only thing you don't want to pick up is the poo. There's poo there. As long as you don't pick that poo up, it's golden. Leave the poo. And then just drop down. And we'll get the charge talisman. Then leave the poo, and he won't wake up. Sneak back up now. Yeah, okay, we're coming for you now. Grab this. We've got a chest as well. I want you to come around this side and grab this one. And this one. Yeah, as long as you leave the poo, you'll stay asleep. Gesture. Get a finger snap.
And everybody's favourite werewolf. Who goes there? Carly sent you, did he? Never the bloody busybody. Hmm. Maybe to him you don't seem so strange. The name's Blythe. He fled somewhere near the left. Can tell me off. I can offer you. Darrowell is not in need of a. Darrowell is not in need of a. Right, if you are a Dex player, we're going to get you one of the best. Dex are quality. Even one of them, we're going to get you the best weapon. I've said probably top five best weapons in the game. Um, not quite yet, actually. What we're going to do. I'm going to go the long way around to it. So, yeah, we're going to get the. We'll eventually get the Bloodhound Fang, which is, yeah, the first playthrough. It is one of the best weapons in the game. In game plus, it kind of goes off a bit, but first playthrough by far up there. Um, it it levels primarily with Dex, but it's I think it's a B Dex and a C Strength, which is really good. The Strength as well. So like I say, if you're doing a quality build, it's good for that. Um, I'm have that, that, and the so, and the move set. Yeah, the move set on it is amazing. It's just a fantastic weapon. Uh, if you're doing either a bleed Dex or quality build, that is the weapon. Why I was going over there. These guys, trolls. Um, if you have a strength weapon, they're really easy because it's two heavy attacks and they're down. If you don't, it's going to take more and a bit of a pain. But we dealt with them before. for this oh that's a bit of a pain oh these invis beetles got nothing for it we're gonna have to line it up properly first yeah you want one with stomp really Stomp as well, and never thought about putting it on anything. Maybe spin. The um, I haven't got any decks to do it though. Right, that's it. Got okay, from heavy. Still should work, shouldn't it? Yeah. You kidding me? Why didn't that work? Mm. Don't make me go back and gain something to stomp. Oh, well, that's just stupid. Um do it one more go. Nice. Right. Absolute pain that is. These guys have a higher chance of dropping feet, bird feet than 
the actual birds. This is where I come to find my feet if I need them. Um, the feet are used. Oh, so you have yellow ones that give you extra wounds. I think it's like 30 seconds. 30 seconds, 60 seconds, something like that. And you have white one that improves your discovery rate or chance. I think it's pretty good for you. I didn't realise I had none of that left. Kill these lot. These um, octopus, land octopuses. I don't know what they're really called. But yeah, do these because they drop stuff that we need for crafting later on. Once you stun them, just go to the side a bit. Yeah, I'm going to have to all of these. Yeah, that's what we need. So these, we use them because later on we'll get a, um, I can't remember what they're called. We get these little pot things. What are they called? I can't remember what they're called. But anyway, you get a few of them. You get one that gives you health. So it's like a mini golden bar. It gives you health and a bubble. There's one that increases your damage that you deal, but you take more damage as well. One that brings fire. And in DLC you get bigger ones of them. Perfumers. Perfumer pots. So, yeah, that's what we, we use them because we use the ones that increases your damage, but you take more damage. Until we get um, Clay and Grotley Strength. Oh, oh. Bok. Don't worry, I'll kick their ass and get your stuff for you. Can we level up? Can we level up? Yes, we can. Right, we're coming up against chieftains. Demi-human chieftains who are weak to everything, I think. Have a look. Demi-human chieftains. Why can't I see them? There they are, two of them. Weak to everything, all elements. Yep. Like minus 10, minus 20 and everything, so... Oh, put the light back on. So a fire will do. And we'll bring a... Um, NPC summoning with us as well to make sure we destroy him. Shield, what do you do? What oh, octopus or what all the Get rid of some of my health before I go in. Right. Uh, this guy will be killing that one, but we'll just bring it down. Because we have a dog.
Kill the uh, chief. We've got about three of them coming up, so nothing too much. But we are going to the first dragon community communion. Dragon communion stuff, they are good if you build into them. Which I've never done, I've never built into them. Um, don't really fascinate me at all. I've had a quick little dabble with them when I've done like a bleed build, but I've never really um, gone all in on them using this, the dragon seal and all that stuff. But I'm not seeing them really good. The only two that I've mainly use is the scarlet bottom frozen ones which we won't get to later on so if you want to be a dragon then you will be benefited with it especially with the dlc where you can turn into one so um this is, beauty of this game compared to all the other souls games is that pretty much every single play style is viable on your first playthrough New Game Plus is a different thing, but first playthrough, pretty much every build is viable. Maybe New Game Plus as well, but after New Game Plus, there's only a handful. Yeah, you look at the Dark Souls, there's only a handful that you can use there that are good. Um, same with Bloodborne. Yeah, but for this, pretty much every single one, any build you can think of, you can pretty much complete the game with and that's one of the beauties of it uh, collect that there's one around here as well I don't know why we haven't bothered picking that up um, I think it's just crafting it's just a dragon yeah dragon's head dragonfly head no dragon's head uh, I think this Scorpion is a is it a zombie? He's a zombie. Yeah. And we've got this and that'll do. That's it for you. Get rid of them. Go and speak to Bok and then go and speak to the vendor. Hello, Bok. Oh. Wait. Is that what I think it is? You got it, it back is. for me. <sighs> what made my mum and that sewing? I always. Thank you. You're very kind. You're welcome. Right, he's done now. Um, let's go to the vendor. This vendor sells pretty much nothing. Oh, he's got some upgrades. I don't think he's got a cookbook. Let's uh, double check. But it is just the upgrade stuff that we want from him. I don't think he's got a. Um, Oh, he has got one cup, but... got a bow, but... You want that bow? No, you don't really want that bow. That shield is only... Yeah, it's only an 80 physical 41. But it's a small shield, and it's not the best. Oh, no, I'll we'll pass on that as well. The sword's not the best, but, no. The only thing worth buying is that... Oh, we'll be able to craft them later, well, so... We will get is pickle foul foot, the yellow and the white one. I think. I think this one down here. 
There's a white one up top, but I think this one down here is yellow. I think. Yes. Back up top. And this is the first steps. First came out of. Grab that and then we're gonna come down here and just just drop. And the corner is the white one. Still gonna pick a foul for. Uh, I should have made it daytime, I guess, shouldn't I? Yeah. Oh well. I think this is a Smith and Stone one. Yep, yeah, some. Be able to solve the painting, which is just here. And that should give us a scarab pat. I've never used any of these scarab pats. There's your painting. Just got bats. Sorry, I know I disturbed you. But I wanted that item. I'm gonna try and make it daytime as much as I possibly can, but I just keep forgetting. Right, that's it. Come at me again. Do you? What you get? to do got them two to do do we want to do that now it didn't really benefit in any way doing that like I mean, there's a chest there that transports you over to Caled don't really want to go to the round table just yet so I might not bother with that chest and there's nothing really I mean you can get the bot dog we're not going to need it. Which I will say, if you're struggling with Margaret, if you get the bot dog, the bot dog will pretty much kill him. Because Margaret's extremely weak to rot. So if, if the bot dog gives him rot, then... So, um, let's, let's grab that. For now. We might grab that after we're done. Gale. So we can do that, do a gale. Get these and then come and speak to him. So we might do that. Yeah, we might do that. Wait. Right. Daytime. Spirit Spring and then we'll come back up here. We're not coming up top, what we are going to do is just miss that and then jump over here. That way, we get a trainer's lily. And a sleeping dog. Oh, wolf. He's our wolf. Yeah. Roll off again, and we've got an alabaster. Now, these guys can be, well, they can be tough. They can be a pain, but just easily stun locked. And we can 
can just play ball and ball with it. can be difficult but it can also be extremely easy and you always get the gravitas from him, always. Now what is more difficult than them is a crabby. You don't want to do it, don't do it. You don't like the fact took his meat. Spray me. Lucky to spray the stir it off. Uh, grab your torch out because we're going back into a cave. But it's not just any cave, it's the very first cave. Um, nearly the very first cave. Because when you first spawned in, if you look around, you would have seen an item up top, and this is it. Talisman you will never use. That said, let's take that one on. No, let's keep them on. Right, here. right and with that done, uh, let's go back to seaside. Make our way around. That one way. Right. One chat to him. Grab that. Is which I never put a thingy there. Grab that. Do them first. So we can get some runes, we want to set these guys off. These are all fighting. You do well to stay clear of the Gil Lake, and it's just free. So stay clear of them. Oh, let's see if it's the fireflies. Don't be a fool. Don't. Don't be a fool. Yes, boss. They're all fighting. If you want to join in, join in. It's three wounds. It's, yeah, it's three wounds. And you might get some good out of it. Or you might just get some strength. So you get naff all out of it. Oh well. It's runes. Why am I complaining? It's runes. Right. Now there will be three there's a crab there and two more will come out of the water the second you go for this. I'm gonna grab it and go. Now all three of them will go for each other Sure, you get your mushroom. That we'll talk to him again in a bit. So now we're gonna fight Darwin. Get a weapon. Grab that. Grab that. Grab that. Darwin is what's Darwin weak to? He is weak to pierce, lightning, poison, rock, bleed. Frost and sleep. Oh. 
sleep. I've never tested sleep on him, ever. Because Blight's always been there, Blight's always been there, so he'd wake him up instantly anyway, so... He's weak to fire. Lightning. I've got no lightning, I've got no pierce. I know what I have got. Why well, I decide to turn up. I have got is a fantastic for you. Hold on, Bly. Good work, that mate. Poof. Work for him then. Could have got a bit hairy. He's going to give us something special. Uh, work for him. I'm not a man of my thing. Yes, two. Oh, yes. If you venture, tell him I said he'll be sure I owe you honor. That's enough chit chat. It's time we part. That's enough chit chat. It's time we part yeah. and wait. Right, so, like I said, Old Hound's Fang, absolutely fantastic. So, um,. I haven't got the decks, but yeah, move set amazing, a fantastic weapon. Highly, highly recommend it. But he's done, so let's go and get this weapon, which is a large club that I will be using a lot. Where's me spirit spring? Drop down here. these and then drop down these tombstones and up another spirit spring this now these starlight shards now have a quick chat about these because they are quite important and these things what they do is when you take one they slowly um, fill your FP meter which sounds really good but you need to use them for the quest later on to buy puppets or summons and we need to leave one um, close to a um, kind of call bonfire things so that because for some reason sometimes part of his quest is to it's uh, shown that you've got a starlight shard now you may have 10 in your inventory uh, but it still won't register so you need to go collect one for it to register that you've got one for the quest to move forward um, so later on we will be when we get to weeping there'll be one there that's right next to a um, grace that's the one i'll be right next to a grace that we'll leave just for that purpose alone yeah don't use them until after Riley's quest. Once Riley's quest, then you won't need them. But that's much, much, much later on. Let's go around and kill one of these. We've got two sorcerers up top. But we don't want them spamming us and telling everybody that we're here. 
That's why I'm sneaking around a little bit. Well, we've got a scroll, so if you're doing sorcery, you can give that to Selen. There, Selen's not too bad because she, she only moves once, so. And I'll be going through her quest anyway. Oh, go away. got a bugle guy as well don't need him why isn't it letting me put the lock on him let me put put the lock on someone further away from him not him there we go we want to take him out quickly that way Oh, well, we can just let him tell everybody that, really. that, that That's even better. Oh, they tell the um, Norse people, so that's good. Oh, yes, he did. Right, we can tell the one that's on the horse. Right, and we get a decent, decent dex weapon. Decent, but old town's fang, you don't need it. Up behind. A dismounter, nice. Give me swords, give me hats. Right, that's them done. Um, do we have any poison? No. Just have that. So for now, I'm going to leave that room bare. So, just in case you want to do that. Right over here, there is going to be a noble. And he's going to look like a normal noble. There he is. Just a normal noble. You kill him, as you might want his sword, you might see the sword, think, oh, I want that sword. Kill him. He will turn into a Roomba, and he will make your day very, very miserable. So, we're going to leave him, because Roomba is a week to poison and rot and so we'll leave him until we get poison arrows so we've done all that um, we've got that we've got that 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 and that that off at Mer Merc Waters. That time is nearly five o'clock. I am hungry. Um, let's get to the next. Oh, we've got to do the invasion, out not we? Yeah. We've got an MPV. M PC invasion. He does heavy bleed damage. He is an absolute pain in the ass, to be honest. But we are going to get help. Well, I say we are going to get help. Eventually, we will get help. Jiria likes to take his time to join in. 
just try and stay away from bleed. That's pretty much it. The area always spawns underneath the bridge. So you basically want to get over there. Nice. Right, let's run. We want you to get to spawning. The end is nigh. Move. For you. And your cess blood. Can you hit me, please? Please. Do something, you earlier, so I can heal. Thank you. Dear God. Yeah, that's a thing. He, he spawns in and then decides to take it. He always takes it. Back in time to come and help you. Now, I'm going to chat to him. Dark already it is. Right. What are you doing here, Skelly? Nope, oh, that's him done. Right. Time to go up and meet Patches. Uh, so this next spot, but the next boss, uh, we don't want to kill. So he's getting to half health. He begs and um, turns into a vendor, and he um, he tells a couple of things that we want. So. We can kill him, but he's also got a quest line, so I'd rather just keep him out of his quest line. Because you get a decent uh, whip, fire whip, if you're doing a fire build. So, yeah, I wouldn't say it's fantastic, but it's a decent whip. It is worth keeping him out just for that. Yay, raggedy cloth. Come on, you. Um, there are loads of fire barrels down here, so I do not want that. Open his chest, that's calling you a thief. And half elf him. Literally it. Um, he does spew. Oh, what he spews at you? He does spit stuff at you. Well, 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 well. Thought you'd just help yourself to a man's personal belongings, huh? You steaming little oh, patches. Dirty rotten scoundrel. Just let me backstab you, will you? Oh, oh, he's not begging. Oh, patches, patches, why are you not begging? Else. Yeah. Yeah. Finally 
get a small yeah. amount of wounds. I knew you would. And yes, now true and true. <laughs> it is if then he becomes a vendor. When you come back and he becomes and he's a vendor, and if you start fighting him then, and then you use that emote on him, you will get a second emote. Um, which I've never done. Not really interested in it. Um, but yeah, just in case you want to collect all the emotes, that is a thing. I think you're gonna forget. Honestly, frankly, so don't. I'll be ready to. <laughs> no, I just want you as a vendor. Oh, travel. Rid of that. Get rid of that. That one because it probably won't be able to buy everything. So just think, just to let me know, there's a NPC that I want to speak to. Arch back out. And it's just ignore everything. No point fighting it all again. We have the cave moss. They can't come through here because this is still classed as a boss arena. Well, nice of you to drop There's a new chest. Me. Leave that to teleport it. Welcome. Where you won't need a teleport you right next to a bunch of rune uh, burrs. Yeah. Now they're all supplied. I mean, but it hardly. They're all foot soldiers. Go for his chat and then start buying stuff. Well, just something like but then again and besides I mean he does start offering you that chest after a while but I've uh, never used these so I know you should I, I know what should but I never fight the torrent I would literally use torrent just to get from A to B so what we want is uh, Margaret's shackle which for me is the most important thing here is not only so talk about this so the far first part, so Margaret is the first legacy boss you're gonna face. Uh, he's gonna be so in the first half of his health bar with this you'll be able to lock him to the floor twice, only in the first part of his health bar. Which is really good. If you're struggling you can just destroy him then. It also lets you um, unveil hidden passages, passageways in caves and catacombs and it also has those little flame um, posts in catacombs that normally block um, areas off. If you slam this, if you use this, it will get rid of them as well. So for me, it's um, with the catacombs it's, and caves and everything, it's fantastic. Grab that, we need to, we need 5,000, 10,000 18,000 20,000 we we'll probably need which for now we won't be able to get because I ain't unlocked the, uh, the farming spot yet so fast travel back out and we should go to um, it's 22 and we have 20 we have to 200 though, and it shouldn't be too bad. So, pretty much, so we're going to go to a cave, and everything in that cave is weak to strike. With this being a strike weapon, it's a really good strike weapon as well. We're going to use that. Plus, if we go into catacombs and all the skeletons and the gargoyles are all weak to strike as well. So, what we're going to do is. Put this on it. No, we're going to do sacred. No, we're going to do standard. Which means that is going to be able to kill every every skeleton with one shot. Because normally what you have to do with skeletons is kill them and then kill them again. And they're on the floor. You see, you'll kill them all on the floor. They'll start going white, and then you have to kill them again. But this you only have to kill them once. It doesn't sound like much, but when there's a, quite a few of them, it is. It's just time. Cause it's just save so much time and hassle and with deaf birds as well and, and tipping the mariners it's just ugh, just awesome a little bit um I'm gonna ignore these skeletons anyway should have made it later let's go 
go to the high little cave. No, it's no or not. Fire here, fire grease. Sticks to the side so we're not um, calling in again. Not ring grave, ring grave tunnel. We do want to get even crabs are extremely weak to. Oh, go away, crabby. Just want to grab these. Extremely weak to strike, so that's another reason why you should have a good strike weapon. We will get a really good one later on. That does bleed as well. But um, for now, that one's the best we're going to get for a while. So we just use that one for now. Then why have I been kicked from my, um, my party again? That has been nuts. Oh, I haven't got it here. Oh, here, when we come into tunnels. You see, always see a lift, but we just don't just take the lift. always go down the side. Down the side, there'll be crystals and upgrade, crafting materials and upgrade materials. Maybe one or two, but there'll still be stuff down the side. So you always just want to just go down the left. Always the left. Just make sure you're careful. I always like to roll off just in case. Um, yeah, clean up. Right, five o'clock, two and a half hours streaming. Should I go and cook? What have I got to cook? Should I do this first? Mm, we've got this, eel, and all these. Um, I think we'll call it there and come back later, I think. Yeah, I'll call it here and come back later, so thank you very much. Got a wave or anything? Ah, oh, that'll be. Well, man, thank you very much. Hope you enjoy. Hope you have a fantastic day and catch you next time. Bye bye.